It was the very first object that visited our vicinity in the solar system from outside the solar system in the vast expanse of the cosmos. Mysteries abound, but few captivate the imagination quite like Umamua, the mysterious interstellar visitor that has astronomers around the world scratching their heads in bewilderment. This celestial wanderer has opposed formal explanations at every turn. Its unusual shape, its bizarre acceleration, and its seemingly unpredictable behavior have led to wild assumptions and heated debate within the scientific community and beyond. What secrets does Umamua hold, and what does its path towards Earth signify for the future of humanity? Join us as we embark on an extraordinary journey to unravel the mysteries of Umamua and its startling approach toward Earth. The story of Umamua began on a memorable day on October 19th, 2017, which marked an exciting moment for those who enjoy looking up at the night sky. In the landscapes of Hawaii, there's a large observational tool known as PANSTARS, Panoramic Survey Telescope, and Rapid Response System. Its main job is to search the skies for any asteroids that might come close to Earth and pose a threat. However, on this particular day, something out of the ordinary occurred. A space scientist named Robert Werick who is skilled at unraveling the mysteries of the universe, was examining the data collected by the telescope. What he came across was extremely unusual. This object, later named Umamua, didn't look like the usual celestial bodies such as rocks, asteroids, or comets that often orbit our sun. The discovery of this strange object quickly grabbed the attention of space enthusiasts and professional astronomers worldwide. They were all eager to point their telescopes towards this abnormality to learn more about it. The efforts to observe and analyze it were serious and widespread. What they found from their combined observations was truly astonishing. This object wasn't behaving like the typical members of our solar system family. It wasn't orbiting the sun in a regular expected path. Instead, it was just passing through suggesting that its origins were from outside their familiar celestial boundaries. Hence, it was named Umamua, a beautiful Hawaiian word chosen by those who first spotted it. This special term, a messenger from afar arriving first, uh, describes something like a cosmic messenger. It's like getting a surprise visit or a mysterious signal from a distant part of our galaxy. This event isn't just interesting to scientists, it's a symbol of how immense and unknown our universe is. When space experts or astronomers saw Umamua, they initially thought it was just an asteroid. It looked like one because it didn't have the usual signs of a comet, like a cloud of gas and dust around it, or a tail trailing behind as it moved through space. But then something unexpected happened. When Umamua started to leave our solar system, it suddenly started to speed up, which was surprising. This sudden burst of speed is usually something they associate with comets, not asteroids. Comets have this cool ability to speed up because as they approach the sun, the heat makes them release gas and dust. This release acts like a natural engine, pushing the comet along faster. Umamua didn't act like a typical comet at all. It didn't have the usual signs like gas or dust emissions, no murky circle around it, and no tail trailing behind. This unusual behavior left scientists puzzled. Umamua seemed to act like a comet in some ways, but looked more like an asteroid in others. This strange mix of traits made Umamua captivating and mysterious. Some scientists think of Umamua as a sort of sneaky comet, different from the ones they're used to. They suggest that maybe it's releasing just a tiny bit of gas or dust, too little for their telescopes to spot. This almost invisible puffing could be why Umamua is speeding up as it leaves the solar system. 
If this is true, then Umamua would be a whole new kind of comet, not fitting the typical image they have of them. Big, bright, with a long tail. On the other hand, there's a wilder idea thrown into the mix by Avi Loeb, a Harvard professor. He's come up with a pretty mind-blowing idea that sounds like something out of a sci-fi story. Loeb suggests that maybe Umamua isn't a natural object like a comet or asteroid at all. He imagines it could be a piece of super advanced technology from another civilization, a super thin reflective sheet or sail catching sunlight to glide through space, like a sailboat catches the wind to move through the water. This light sail could be an artificial object sent from far away, maybe even from another solar system. Loeb highlights that Umamua stands out due to its unusual shape, shiny surface, and unusual movement, which oppose their usual understanding of space object. What makes his idea so captivating is what it implies. If Umamua were indeed a probe from an alien civilization, it would mark a groundbreaking discovery, suggesting the existence of other intelligent beings in the universe. This idea sparks excitement and ignites the imagination, hinting at the possibility that they are not alone in the vast expanse of the universe. However, while the idea of aliens is thrilling, it's crucial to approach it with caution. This theory is just one among many, and most experts remain doubtful. They prefer explanations rooted in natural cosmic events, especially since the evidence supporting the alien hypothesis is limited. Moreover, with Umamua now out of reach and much still unknown about it, as well as the countless other mysteries in space, many scientists support focusing on more grounded theories. Nevertheless, the ongoing debate surrounding Umamua underscores the huge mysteries and potential discoveries awaiting them beyond Earth. Since its appearance, scientists have grappled with understanding this mysterious visitor without resorting to extraterrestrial explanations. They've proposed various theories, including the possibility that Umamua is a piece from a larger celestial body, similar to finding a lone mystery piece without knowing the full picture it belongs to. Thus, when they study Umamua, they're essentially examining a fragment of an unknown origin, much like discovering an ancient artifact without knowing its complete history. Assumptions abound about its origins and purpose, but without the complete context, their understanding remains incomplete. This ongoing pursuit invites them to keep an open mind and continue exploring the mysteries of the universe. One interesting idea scientists have put forward is that Umamua could be a hydrogen iceberg. It's a bit of a mind-bender because unlike the icebergs they're familiar with, this one would be made of frozen hydrogen gas, a substance they usually encounter as a gas. The theory goes like this. If Umamua hails from a super chilly corner of the galaxy, it might have formed from this exotic form of ice. As Umamua swung by the sun, the theory suggests that the heat caused the frozen hydrogen to transform directly into gas, a process called sublimation, this gas release might have nudged Umamua along, boosting its speed without the flashy tail typical of comets. Some scientists are raising their eyebrows, wondering if something as delicate as a hydrogen iceberg could even survive the rough-and-tumble journey through space. Cosmic radiation and other cosmic mischief could easily tear it apart. Yet, for some stargazers, Umamua represents a whole new breed of celestial voyagers. They guess that it might be the first of its kind, born from strange events in distant star systems. This strange space object has caught everyone's attention with its unusual shape. It's incredibly long and skinny, unlike anything they've ever seen in our solar system. Imagine a stretched-out cucumber ten times longer than usual, and they'll start to grasp the unique dimensions of Umamua. It spans about 800 meters in length, but it's only about 80 meters wide. 
giving it a celestial appearance similar to a cigar or a needle. Pinpointing its exact shape is tricky because it's so distant and difficult to observe, even with the most advanced telescopes. This challenge adds to the excitement and interest surrounding Umamua. Despite its distance and their faint view, they're certain it doesn't resemble anything else they've seen orbiting the sun. Its unique structure and its movement through space have left scientists puzzled, wondering about its origins and the forces that have shaped it. This unpredictable spinning suggests to many scientists that Umamua has encountered serious disturbances in the past. They assume it might have collided with something large or been rapidly ejected from its original orbit. What's particularly fascinating is that it's speeding up as it moves away from the sun. This acceleration isn't solely due to the sun's gravitational pull. There appears to be an unknown force providing an additional push, and they're still trying to unravel that mystery. Clues about this force can be gleaned from Umamua's appearance. It sports a deep red hue, reminiscent of objects found far beyond Neptune. This color often indicates the presence of organic molecules on the surface, the building blocks of life. Although they can't say for sure that Umamua harbors life, it appears to possess some crucial elements necessary for it. Its peculiar appearance, strange coloration, and the mysterious forces influencing it all contribute to the secret it presents in the heavens. It's similar to a gripping tale from a mystery novel unfolding in the vast expanse of space. Each discovery they make about Umamua unravels a new chapter, not only about this peculiar object, but also about the universe at large. Imagine Umamua's epic journey through the cosmos, a journey spanning billions of years, a solitary voyage through the frigid darkness between stars. Along its path, it endures a relentless barrage of cosmic rays, energetic particles hurtling through space at great speeds. These particles bombard Umamua, altering its composition and causing its surface to darken and take on a reddish hue. This metamorphosis serves as a vital clue for scientists, hinting at Umamua's extensive sojourn across the galaxy enduring the rigors of space and bearing the scars of countless cosmic encounters. These cosmic rays aren't just ordinary bursts of energy. They possess the remarkable ability to forge complex organic molecules, a crucial step in the potential emergence of life. While these molecules aren't living beings themselves, they represent the foundational building blocks essential for life's genesis. This revelation is nothing short of astonishing, suggesting that Umamua may be more than a mere wanderer in the vastness of space. It could be a carrier of the very elements conducive to life's creation. Millennia of traversing the cosmic void, subjected to the relentless onslaught of cosmic events, may have endowed its surface with a rich tangling of chemicals and compounds. The interstellar environment where Umamua silently drifts is harsh and unforgiving. Yet, paradoxically, it serves as a sanctuary, preserving celestial objects like Umamua despite the harsh conditions. Imagine a captivating idea called the Gravity Assist Move, almost like a space game of tag. Zooming near a huge cosmic object like a planet or a star, getting a powerful speed boost from its gravity, shooting forward much faster. That's what happens in space. Scientists study these speed boosts caused by gravity, like what happens to the object Umamua, as it passes by big space objects such as planets and stars in our solar system. They carefully count these boosts, which add up as Umam travels through space. By doing this, they become like space detectives, trying to figure out where Umamua came from. 
Many scientists are on a mission to find the star systems or individual stars that Umamua might have passed by during its journey across the universe. They guess about groups of young stars and even specific stars, like HIP 3757 and HD 292249 that might have had close encounters with Umamua a long time ago. But figuring out the exact stellar neighborhood where Umamua originated is extremely tough. Their grasp of Umam's exact speed and the path it's taking through space isn't complete. Imagine the galaxy as a busy highway, with stars and planets constantly moving, making it tricky to trace Umamua's original journey. If Umamua got a boost from expelling material like a cosmic engine, figuring out its precise route gets even trickier. As Umamua travels through the vast expanse between stars, it's moving through what scientists call the interstellar medium, a sparse, wide mix resembling a thin cosmic soup made of tiny dust, gases, and fast-moving charged particles. Despite how sparse it seems, this space soup gradually influences objects like Umamua over long periods subtly altering their paths. This slow, elegant dance with interstellar matter adds an extra layer of mystery to Umamua's tale. When scientists try to trace the huge journey Umamua has made, they have to factor in these gentle, persistent nudges. Umamua was a crucial discovery because it offered us a glimpse into the mysterious stretches of space beyond our familiar solar neighborhood. Usually, objects in space move in predictable paths around the sun, following circular or oval orbits. However, Umam behaves differently. It follows what's called a hyperbolic path, meaning it's on a one-way journey through our solar system. Unlike planets and comets that orbit the sun repeatedly, Umamua swung by once, got a speed boost from the sun's gravity, and is now zooming out of our solar system forever. This makes Umamua not just a wanderer, but a cosmic sprinter, racing away on a path that will take it far into the depths of space, never to return to our solar neighborhood. This unique behavior gives scientists a rare chance to study an object from a completely different part of our galaxy offering insights into the vast and mysterious universe beyond their immediate reach. The speed Umamua reached is astonishing. It zoomed ahead at about 26 kilometers per s. It's so incredibly swift that it's not only leaving our sun behind in its cosmic rearview mirror, it's bidding farewell to the entire solar system. Now it's soaring toward a part of the sky known as the constellation Pegasus. And it doesn't intend to turn back. It's similar to a bird migrating to warmer climates for the winter. Except Umamua isn't just leaving for the season. It's leaving forever. Consider Umamua's visit as a unique once-in-a-lifetime occurrence because of its remarkable speed. Even the sun's mighty gravitational pull can't lure it back for an encore. After it zipped past us, all our astronomers could do was monitor its path, analyze data, and glean as much insight as possible from this fleeting encounter. They've concluded that it will carry on its solitary journey across the universe, drifting through the boundless expanse of stars in our Milky Way. Perhaps it will intersect with other solar systems or wander through the desolate expanses between stars, continuing its silent expedition through the universe for countless years to come. Imagine Umamua as a colossal arrow soaring through the vastness of space, directly aimed at us from the celestial depths. It's like a gigantic cosmic pointer catching the attention of scientists worldwide. They've been intensely observing its movement, noticing something peculiar. Unlike the graceful orbits of our familiar planets like Earth and Mars, Umamua follows a straight path, termed a hyperbolic trajectory by those in the know. This unusual route hints that Umamua isn't a local traveler. 
Instead, it seems to have journeyed from a distant corner of the universe far beyond our solar neighborhood. The direction from which Umamua arrived adds another layer of interest. It appears to have originated from the region of the sky where the constellation Lyra resides. Just imagine gazing upwards and identifying a cluster of stars. That's Lyra, a distant pattern moment in the night. However, pinpointing Umamua's exact celestial hangout before its visit is similar to finding a needle in a haystack. Space is unimaginably vast, with the visitor possibly traversing it for eons before gracing our celestial doorstep. Consider a sprawling beach, each grain of sand representing a celestial body. Now imagine the challenge of tracing the origin of just one of those grains back to its original rock millions of years ago. That's the puzzle astronomers face when trying to uncover Umamua's birthplace. The universe, vast and ever-changing, presents an immense challenge. Despite their advanced technology and expertise, unraveling the mysteries of space remains a monumental task. They're just scratching the surface of understanding the complexities that lie within the universe. The path Umamua took into our solar system provides scientists with valuable clues, acting like a compass guiding them to distant realms in the vast cosmic ocean beyond our solar system. This information might seem small, but it's a significant piece of the cosmic puzzle, enriching their understanding of how the universe is structured and how celestial bodies traverse space. As for Umamua's return visit to Earth, it's doubtful. Imagine a spaceship zooming past a planet at incredible speed, bypassing its gravitational pull and continuing its journey in a straight line. That's precisely what Umamua did. Its path through our solar system resembled a fleeting cosmic traveler, making a brief stop and then moving on, never to return within our lifetime or even for generations to come. This rare event allowed us a unique opportunity to witness a visitor from the depths of space pass through our celestial neighborhood. Despite being a one-time visitor, Umamua's significance remains undiminished. It can be likened to a cosmic messenger carrying secrets from a distant corner of our galaxy, coincidentally passing by our solar system. While it doesn't communicate with us directly, the information they can glean from its speed, path, and physical characteristics is immensely valuable. By studying these aspects, scientists can unravel mysteries about the conditions and forces shaping other parts of the Milky Way. What are your thoughts on the movement of Umamua toward the Earth? Let us have your opinions in the comments below. Thanks for watching another episode of Space Voyager. While you are still here, make sure to click the video on your screen,